guys, today I'm going to show you my makeup accessories and like the products I use to put on my makeup. So these like include brushes, wedges, like eyelash curlers and things like that. So I'm going to start off with eyelash curlers. I just have the Primark one pound eyelash curlers because these are really really good. They've lasted me a long time so I really really like these. Um, so yeah, that's the Primark eyelash curlers. Um, then I have these makeup wedges which I just recently purchased and if I take it out, um, I've just used one and I use these to blend in my foundation um, and I've still got five left. So I'll just put it in the packet just because it looks more tidy. So yeah, I've got those. Um, then for brushes, or I'll start off with these miniature like things that you get in like palettes and stuff like that. So I've got loads of these sponge applicators. This is a new one, and I just use these for every day when I'm just applying eyeshadow lazily. Um, and then I have two lip brush brushes, and I've got this really small brush, which I don't know what you use it for. It's meant to be for blush, but it's so small, you can't even use it for blush. So I think I'll just use that for eyeshadow. And now I'm going to move on to my brushes. I've got a Kabuki, and um, this is like a mini Kabuki, and this is just the Maybelline New York Kabuki. And this is really, really dense, and I use this to um, apply my foundation or like buff powder in. Um, and then I've got this brush set that I'll put in this little pot. I don't know where I got this pot from, but it's just a black pot which holds this, these brushes nicely. And I bought this today, um, and this was from Poundland, and it looks like this. They look like they're not going to be the best of brushes, but I wanted to, like, try out brushes because I haven't got much brushes, so... Um, I got these, and um, this one's meant to be a blush brush. I think I'll take these to school because I don't mind if they get dirty or if they get lost because they were pound. And I thought the handles was really, really cute because they're like spotty. It's so adorable. Um, so yeah, this is one pound altogether, and um, this is a blush brush. You get a uh, like fluffy blending brush and you get a eyeshadow brush just to pack on colour you get a brow brush you get a um, con like eye crease brush I guess and you get these sponge applicators which I love because these are so big and it's got a handle so I think I like this one the most because I haven't got one of these with a handle so I thought with the black um, kind of holder it matches the brushes because it's got a black handle kind of these things so yeah I thought that looks cute so I've got those then I've got brushes that I bought separately um, I've got a stippling brush which is by QBS and I use, I bought this to put on foundation, but um, it's not dense enough, so I use it to apply blusher, and I really like it for that. And I have a blusher brush, which I got from Poundland again, but this is really really soft. 
It's really good quality. And this was by a brand called Alura. And this was from Poundland again. And this is Big Fluffy Powder Brush, which I love. I've had this for a really long time and it hasn't shed or anything like that. And I've washed this lots of times. Um, so yeah, this was by the brand called Allure again, but the handles are like different colours. This one's black, this one's like a reddy kind of colour. So yeah, I've got that. And then, I've got eye brushes. This one I use um, to apply like crease colour. Eyeliner brush pack on like eyeshadow so like this is an eyeshadow brush a lip brush and an angled brush and I just have some tweezers so I'll just put all of those brushes back so I can show you my main brush kit which is like a uh, Kit which I bought, and this is the Royal Cosmetics Connections Bronzing Brush Set. And um, these are all the brushes you get. This is why it comes in, and this is like my main brush kit, and um, I'm going to use this for travelling and things like that so I'm not going to try to get these dirty I use these like the brushes that I've just shown you they're like my everyday brush but this brush is what I'm going to take with me while I'm travelling so yeah because people might get confused um, so that's like an overview um, I'll just go through what kind of brushes they have so they have a powder brush, it's really, really soft and I really like the handles, they've got like a print to them which is really cute. So this is a powder brush and um, I guess you can use this for blush as well because it's really big and fluffy. And it's good that they come with these brush cards so like they keep their shape and then you get a foundation brush and this is really really soft and it's really really dense so I can tell that the foundation is going to go on really nicely so it's not and it's not going to be streaky at all and there's lots of like fibers in here so it feels really really dense but not so dense that it's going to like really scratch your face or anything and it's got the same pattern and it comes with a brush guard um, the like bigger brushes come with brush guards but the smaller brushes don't so this is a foundation brush that you get and then you get a blending brush and these come in these packets um, this is really really nice and soft and it's really really good so yeah that then you get an eyeshadow brush which looks like this and I use this to pack on colour That looks good, and then you get a angled eyeshadow brush. And I think you use this to apply like colour on your crease. I thought I was going to use this for eyeliner, but it's not dense enough to apply eyeliner because you need a quite a dense brush for eyeliner. So I think I'll use this to apply colour on my crease. Then there's lip brush, which looks like this. And then you get a brow groomer, which looks like this.
so that's the brow groomer and um, i hope you enjoyed this video guys thanks for watching bye